What is up, YouTube? The Petronator here, and today we will be not doing a card trick, surprisingly, because believe it or not, our channel is not only meant for card tricks and stuff like that. The because this is my second channel, Petronator. I mean, not the Petr. Yeah, I, the Petronator here, but uh, this is my second channel, so I'm not only doing card tricks in it. Um, because my friends are doing this channel too, I thought that they could do some stuff too, so they don't do card tricks at all. So, today we're just brainstorming ideas, because we're going to be doing a bunch of stuff like gaming reviews, book reviews, anything random like that. It's going to be really fun with this channel. Challenges. So, today I will be reviewing Carl. I got this for Christmas, and it is awesome. Go out and buy one if you like it. I think I got the newest version and it was $25, but it's worth the money. Um, but, so, let me tell you a little story about myself. I have not used a pencil like this. I always use mechanical pencils in five years. So, I'm pretty nervous about using these because I, I just hate the feeling. They go, like, with pencils. I, I can't deal with it. It's just, like, crazy. So that's why I need my pencils to be very sharp. I but the school sharpeners are terrible, so they're never gonna work. And that's why I am I got this sharpener for Christmas. Oh my god, that's why I was getting all the stuff all over my table. All right, so that's why I got this for Christmas because I was asking for it for a while because I needed something to make my pencil sharp. And today I will be testing it and talking about how awesome it is. So we're gonna pull it out. Let's. This is how you do it. Um, so if you do get this product, it does not come with, it comes with a desk clamp. It does come with a desk clamp, I mean. But when we first got it, we didn't know what the desk clamp was. So don't worry about it. it you can clamp it to your desk if you want to, but I'm not doing that because I like it like this. We spent a long time trying to figure it out. And this little handle right here will fall out, but you just have to push it in a little bit and twist it. But, so first of all, what, how you do it is if you want this part to go back inside, I think you just push up on that little bar right there, see? Push it up, and then, yeah, you have it like that. So, next what you do is, so let's start sharpening pencils right here. So first what you do is pull out this thing, and then you pinch this little part right here. Well, to pull it out first, I'll show you how to pull it out. You just t pull it out, <laughs> and then you have it like this, extended and stuff. And you're going to clamp your pencil in by squeezing these two little things up here. And then pushing it through into the little pencil thing. And it holds your pencil for you. And then, I, and then you just twist this back thing. Wait, I don't think I put it in all the way. I'm not sure though. Did I put it in all the way? I don't feel anything. I guess I did. We'll do another pencil after this to show you how real it is. And look at that. Hey, that's the first pencil. We're going to do that again because I don't think I put it in all the way. And um, so we're going to just squeeze it in, put it in. And now we have it like that clamped it and everything. I honestly don't think I have it in all the way. I think so. Something's going wrong with me. Because I do not feel anything. It should feel stuff. But it is sharpening. Wait, oh, I know why. We need to pull it down all the way. Let me try it now. Oh, we should really get it in there. Oh yeah, now I feel it. And then it will actually loosen up when it's finished. See how it like start to start feeling a little loose because the pencil is getting finished. Oh, I usually that's why. Alright, so the reason I was doing that is because for some reason with me, I seem to it seems to work better when I grab it down here. It's really weird. But see it's sharp now very sharp it doesn't really matter but I just twist a lot better like that so I'll do it one more pencil and we'll try it down there
Yeah, I feel it now. And after that, that few shot, see how it stopped like getting really hard to push through. That means it's done, and see, you can you don't hear anything more. So it actually tells you when it's done. So see now I just pull it out. Look at that. So now I have three very sharp pencils to bring to school to, on in two weeks. So that is my review of the Carl Pencil Sharpener. It's about $25, as I said a minute ago. Um, you guys, really, it's really worth it, I promise you. You won't be sad. You won't be left out, down. This, this the pencil sharpener is probably going to be, like, the best thing ever for me. Um, so... Yeah, and I am going to try to figure out a way to get rid of, to get a tripod to hang over this thing so you don't have to see all my stuff like from where my desk is right over there and you can just see it from where my car area is because this is kind of like getting old for me so I really want a tripod because I like really <laughs> um so thank you for watching guys this is my Carl pencil sharpener review I hope you enjoyed subscribe and like to KPE it would really mean a lot and yeah.